All right, let's talk about something that's taken the world by storm right now. Uh, Lincoln Park has dropped a new single, not only a new single, but they've dropped info about a new album and a new tour that they are on. Uh, this is their first tour since mid 2017. Oh my God. That's been over seven years ago. Holy. The last show that they played was the Chester tribute show. And that was in, I think it was October of 2017, but uh, the new vocalist, Emily Armstrong of the band dead Sarah. So interesting that they chose to go with a female vocalist. Uh, I'm, hey, I'm always intrigued for anything Linkin Park. Uh, the new album will be titled From Zero. It's a 12-track album to be released on November 15th. And The Emptiness Machine will be the second track off of that album. So this, to me, intrigues me even more because, you know, Whenever you have the, the first song is like, it's, it's going to be an intro. So it's not going to be anything really more than just kind of a tone setter for the album, a tone setter for, you know, the next track, which is the emptiness machine on that album. So, uh, this is going to be big cause this is the first like full song on the album. So it's gotta come in pretty hard so i i ain't wasting time thanks for being here thumb it up if you enjoy buttons down below fun stuff description link to the video uh apologies if it has to be covered it more than likely will uh yeah but i'm sorry i gotta do what i gotta do uh socials are up here if you want to follow me outside of youtube fun stuff all right let's zip let's jam the emptiness machine lincoln park let's go all right, Lincoln Park LP 2K24. Your blades are sharpened with precision. Flashing your favorite point of view. I know you're waiting in the distance. Just like you always do. Just like you always do. Already pulling me in. Wow. Me bleed, gave up who I am for who oh wow me so yeah like a new Lincoln Park era okay Oh, she got some rasp in her voice. Hold on, quick, a quick timeout pause. This isn't going to be a very long video, so I, I think I can get a pause or two in here. So I was very intrigued to see how a female vocalist would do in Linkin Park because everything that we've known from Linkin Park has been Mike and Chester. You know, was Chester's just the emotion he put into into every single scream he did his beautiful cleans. I, I wasn't sure what this was going to bring. I'm not familiar with Emily. I'm not familiar with dead Sarah. So it's like, what's it going to be? And she brought the rasp in, uh, in the verse. 
And she definitely brought the heavy in the chorus. So it's weird hearing Mike not do like his traditional like rapping side. Mm. Mm. Uh, that's a very nice surprise. Let's take it back a few seconds. Let's keep going. Come on. Oh my god holy okay oh man all right that was lincoln park with the emptiness machine off of the upcoming album from zero november 15th and i'll be honest i was incredibly surprised with how much i enjoyed this now with lincoln park like i said earlier everybody everybody knows you know the distinct voice of mike shinoda the distinct voice of chester bennington it's it's Lincoln Park, man. So to come out with something different, I feel like you, you kind of hit, you have to hit the nail on the head. And I think Emily Armstrong did that. I think she, she gave the old Lincoln Park fans kind of enough to kind of like sate the appetite, you know? Yeah, I thought Emily was phenomenal on this. And like I said, it was kind of weird to hear um, Mike not do his traditional rapping but you know maybe that's going to be a thing going forward where they kind of leave that in the past a little bit and it's going to be like a new era of lincoln park i don't know all i know is i'm gonna be checking out more stuff when it comes out for the album and when the album comes out we're gonna do a full album reaction to it there's just absolutely there's no doubt about it uh i already ordered this pre-album or I already <laughs> pre-ordered this album um, before I started doing this ending here, but wow, very, very cool. And I cannot wait to see uh, what comes next from this album. From Zero, November 15th, it's 2024, and we are getting a new Linkin Park album, damn it. Super cool, super great song. I loved everything about this. So, okay. My expectations for this was if I like it, it's probably going to take me a little bit of time to adjust to it being Linkin Park. No, not at all. You know, and for somebody to say like, oh, this isn't Linkin Park. This isn't Linkin Park. I think it does a disservice to, you know, the rest of the band. You know, the band was not one person, although a lot of people may, you know, know the band from one person or they just know that like distinct sound of one person in the band you know i think we just gotta we have to cherish the memories of listening to lincoln park with chester but i think we also have to accept and applaud the band for moving forward i wonder if they're gonna be playing any other songs from this album uh the upcoming album on the new tour Actually, I'm going to be checking out some uh, of her live performances with Linkin Park. I'd love to hear her, uh, her kind of her take on the uh, Chester songs. But yeah, this was a very, very cool track. I am very excited for the new album. 
and I'm going to be all here for it. So what did you guys think of it? Let me know down in the comment section. If you enjoyed the video today, hit it with a thumbs up. Subscribe if you are not already. The notification bell is there so you do not miss when we check out another Linkin Park upload. Uh, whenever that comes, I have no idea. But yep, new album coming out in a little over two months. So can't wait. My socials are up here if you want to follow me outside of YouTube. In the description, link to this uh, music video. I missed a lyric video. Good God. Uh, and if you enjoyed it enough, go to the link in the description. Hit this video with a thumbs up that, that we're, we just watched. You know what? Go on YouTube and just thumb up every video you see. But <laughs> All right, guys. I'm out of here. Thank you so much for spending your time with me. It is always so appreciated. You could be anywhere in the world, yet you're spending time with me right now watching me be weird. But... Yeah. All right. I'm out. Take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. I'll be seeing you all very soon with another Empreax. Thank you.